Hi guys, uh, today's video is about uh, should I wait for the 40 series uh, GPU or should I go and get a 3090 Ti or any 30 series card, 3070 Ti and up on Amazon. As you can see here, they have a 3090 Ti for $1199 American. Um, you can even get a good card here, uh, 3070 Ti for roughly $671, $649. That's a very good card. A 3070 Ti is a very good card. So a lot of people are saying, oh, you know, I should wait for the 40s uh, series uh, GPU. I'm going to explain to you guys something. There's a few people making YouTube videos saying, uh, yeah, you know, don't buy this. Wait. You know what? I'll tell you right now. If this is all you need for your needs, then buy it. Okay? Don't wait. Don't listen to other people that are telling you to wait. Because I'm going to explain to you what that wait is comes with okay that waiting comes with a 4080 or a 4090 ti gpu is going to be consuming tons of power okay 600 watts and up probably okay number two you're going to need over 1200 watts or higher power supply psu to run it number three they got to have an adapter for that psu for your existing psu okay meaning if they're going to be running pcie 5 on a 4090s video card now your PSU does not have the connection for PCIe 5. You're going to have to get a PSU that's PCIe 5 or they have to come out with an adapter and even if they have an adapter you're going to lose performance because you do lose performance when you're using adapters because it's not a direct connection to the power supply. Okay so to make it easy for you people that needs to just get a nice GPU for gaming this is good enough. 3070 Ti is more than plenty. If you're going to be playing Fortnite or whatever you're going to be playing. Uh, if you got extra money, then get the 3090 Ti and call it a day. For $1199, you got a beautiful GPU. Okay, But I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. Once the 40 series comes out and people are going to realize they need to buy a new PSU, they're not going to go and do that. They're just going to buy something like this. Or they're going to regret that they would have bought something like this. And this is going to drive the demand for 30 series video cards once the 40s comes out. So people are thinking, yeah, you know, the 30 series cards are going to go down in price. They have already gone down in price. And they may just go up in price because not everyone's going to want to replace their PSU. Just to let you guys know. Unless you guys have money, then that's different. You want to wait and you guys have a couple thousand dollars in the bank that you want to throw on the 4090 Ti. And you want to overhaul your whole system to a generation five, then that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. You can wait and, and it's all good. But like I said, if you have an existing PSU, 1200 watts or higher, and they come out with the adapters, you won't lose so much performance. But on people that have 850 watt power supplies, well, you know what? Waiting around is not gonna be a good solution for you people. So if you have an 850 watt power supply, to be honest with you, I would go with the 3070 Ti. I won't even go 3080 or 3090 because it's too much power, even for a 30, even for an 850 watt power supply. This is a sweet spot. 3070 Ti with an 850 watt power supply, you're good. And you don't need to do any further upgrades. As long as you're happy with the performance, the gaming, it's fine. So guys, to make a long story short, uh, waiting for the 4090s or uh, 4080 video card is going to be pricey for the card. And it's going to be pricey because you're going to have to change other components in your computer which nobody tells you that but i'm just letting you know that that's what's going to happen so anyways guys uh hopefully you guys enjoy the video you can watch all the youtube videos of people saying don't buy this but if you this is all you really need then go ahead and get it for a good price okay anyways guys take care